Make sure you like and subscribe, because it's direct time. Mario game? What? I have no idea what kind of new Mario Luigi game is this. But this is something. What is this? Mario and Luigi 1. So it's a new Mario Luigi RPG game. I actually will do want to try one of these games before, but I haven't gone into them. But man, new Mario Luigi. We just got a thousand year door last month. I wonder what's new with this one. This is so neat. Warp. Ooh. <laughs> Slamming hammers with hammers. <laughs> this is so fascinating. I don't know what else to predict for the rest of this direct, but dang, this is so something. There was Princess Peach for a second. And Bowser. Ooh. What on earth really is this? Kiki Jones. Mario Luigi. Brothership. Ah. Coming November 7. So, wow, not that long. Alright. See what they are. Bring the championships on. On the there we go. Nintendo World Championships NES Edition. I just saw the trailer for this not that long ago, but man, I kind of wanted to try this game. Like I played the Nintendo World Championships game emulated, not the actual cartridge, because I don't have an NES. But man, this is so fascinating. I know most people may not be that interested in this game, but honestly, if they're going to do this, please have more games like wondering what happened to Rad Racer and Tetris. Those are, those are games that should be on that collection. Alright. Survival mode. In the World Championships, NES Edition, coming next month, July 18th. Alright. We already know. And, of course, the Deluxe Set. I kind of want to pre-order this game, but I'm waiting for this edition to be in stock for pre-order. Fairy tale. Oh, 
All right, a fairy tale game on the Switch. A fairy tale two. More switch sports. What sport will it be? Basketball. Hulk shucks. I'm pretty much a basketball player, so I'm surprised to see this. Oh wow. Well, well, we either get a basketball attachment for the Joy Cons, cause I remember there was a Wii attachment that looked like a basketball, but. Man, I'm willing to give this a shot. Haven't played Switch Sports in a while, but wow. Basketball on Switch Sports. Man. Man. Available this summer. Alright. Later today. Alright, I don't have the game, but this is actually. Hello Kitty. Is this Sambrio? Hello Kitty Island Adventure. Alright. I don't think I should care about most of this stuff, but. I don't, I don't want to be that kind of person who is unfair to playing some of this. Looney Tunes Wacky World of Sports. Alright, we're getting a Looney Tunes game on the Switch. Among Us. Among Us. Later today, alright. I haven't played Among Us for a while. So it's basically a RPG farm simulator, a farm simulator RPG, but a lot near here. Yeah. Donkey Kong? Are they making a third con- Derm They're remaking Donkey Kong Country Returns for the third time. Or second, because I remember playing the 3DS version of this game, but wow, Donkey Kong Country Returns HD. We have 3D and now HD. I don't know when the hell will they make a new Donkey Kong Country game. And no, Tropical Freeze doesn't really count, but dang. I don't know if I want to replay this, but man, so neat. But what's new with this one? Alright. Oh, really? 
So both the Wii and 3DS levels are there. Um, country returns the coming January 16 next year. Alright. What would be the time is what is this? Dragon Quest. Okay, I think this is a new Dragon Quest game. All right, the hour of drawn sneer. New Dragon Quest game, Dragon Quest 3 HD 2 Day Remake. Alright. Pretty impressive. Pretty impressive. So, Dragon Quest 3 is being remade. Coming in November. All right. Just pretty neat. Pretty neat so far. How long would? Oh, it's just a. All right. The, the complete air trick. Also, one and two are being remade. Coming next year, 2025. Alright, so all three Dragon Quest games are being remade. Fusions coming September 13th. Ah, we just mentioned HD. We just mentioned 2 HD. That's coming this month. Not that long. Right. The new Dempa Man. Switch online. All right. So we got Zelda Link: A Link to the Past, Slash Four Sword. Link. Link. 
into the past four, so that's on Game Boy Advance. Metroid Zero Mission! I've been wanting to play this game. Alright, Zero Mission on Switch Online. N64 Mature 17. I don't know if that will still be in the original uh, N64 Online. Player today! Yo! Alright. Something about Street Fighter or Capcom? Oh. Marvel vs. Capcom. Marvel vs. Capcom fighting collection. Alright. So Marvel vs. Cap comes on the switch. Capcom fine collection. Okay, classics. Just this year. All right, no release date. Just this year. Mario Party. A new Mario Party game. Or okay. So we now we have Super Mario Party. So Super Mario Party Jamboree. This is probably a sequel to Super Mario Party. Mario Party Battle Royale, I guess. Or not Battle Royale, uh, online. I forgot how. Man, I'm literally speechless right now. More. October 17th. Right. Super Mario Party Jamboree. Hey, probably looking forward for this. Wow. What is it now? Something to do with Zelda, I think. Oh, bro. Wait. All right, a new Zelda game. This may be a remake or something, I don't know. Oh my god. I was thinking it might be a game that we play as like it's usual, but no. We're playing as Zelda in this one. We're actually playing as Zelda. The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. Okay. Hello, Numa san. Numa san. Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. This time around, Link has vanished. Now, 
it's up to Princess Zelda to step into the protagonist role. You might be thinking, will Zelda fight with a sword then? Here, we wanted to create a new gameplay style that breaks conventions seen in past Legend of Zelda games with a top-down perspective. To explain more, please take a look at this video. Take it. Stolen no away. Across the vast lands of Hyrule, a strange rifts have appeared and have taken many people, including Link. Now alone, Zelda meets the fairy Tri, receives a mysterious staff called the Tri Rod. In the Tri Rod, at a table she found, Zelda learned how to create an imitation of it called an Echo. Once you learn an Echo, an echo you table. Can recreate it whenever you like. Man. Even if there's a wall blocking your path, you can create echoes of tables to get a leg up. <laughs> Just like that. You can create wooden boxes, old beds, and unusual things like water blocks. How you use them separately or together is entirely up to you. It's pretty neat. Learn and create echoes of things you find while exploring Hyrule. Uh. You might be surprised at what you discover. Even battles will look different. You can pick up and throw a rock echo, for example. Or okay. You can also create echoes of monsters. After doing what? That, they'll bite by your side. That's pretty fascinating. Wisdom is key after all. Pretty impressive. I enjoyed this demonstration of the Echo ability, which channels Princess Zelda's wisdom. There are a lot of Echoes in this game. To be honest, I haven't counted them all yet. Hmm. How you solve puzzles and battle enemies will change depending on the Echoes used. In short, we've created a game where each player's experience will be different. The Zelda, the uh, Council of Wisdom, coming September 26. Jeez. Ooh. That's pretty neat. We hope you're looking forward to playing as Zelda in this new adventure. That's a close. I'd like to return this moment I stolen away back to Mr. Takahashi. Basically, that Switch Lite's the closest thing for the Switch 2, I guess. Munch 2. Go over here. Ah. I saw this in Stubborn Game Fest. Lego Horizons Adventures. So basically, this is a Sony game that's also on Switch. Not like the actual Sony Horizon games, but this is Lego Horizons. Dang. I don't know what the hell they'll do next. Lego God of War and it'll be on PS5 and Switch and PC? I don't know. It'll be so mysterious because Horizon isn't on the Switch. It's basically. Sorry. It's basically a PlayStation exclusive, like Zero Dawn's on PS4 and Forbidden West, obviously PS5. Haven't tried the series yet, but I don't know. Comment down below if y'all think I should play Horizon before this game. Coming this holiday. Seen the PlayStation Studios logo in the day. Stray? Oh, jeez. Stray's on the Switch! I forgot it was on the Switch before or not, but dang. Nope. And it's on, uh, it's on the Switch now. Explore alongside a drone known as B12 to find your way home. Carefully climb to the highest heights. 
cats out of the bag for this game. Coming this holiday. All right. It was on PS5 and Xbox back in 2022, and now this year it'll be on Switch. What? What game is this? That's literally a ghost showing his brain. Saga coming October twenty four. Hey, we hope you're excited to experience the full remake of Romancing Saga two. All right, that's almost everything for today's Nintendo Direct. Okay. Next will be our last announcement. Please take a look. Either Metro Prime four or something else. I don't know what it is. Year 20x9. Back configuration for silly. No. I think this might be it. I think this is actually Metroid Prime 4. That's Samus. Or it might be a different Metroid. Prime game. Whoa. Man. It's pretty neat. Oh my god, it is Metroid Prime 4! Beyond- Metroid Prime 4 Beyond! Dang, we've been waiting centuries for that game. I don't know why I cut my sentence there, but dang. Alright, Metroid Prime 4 Beyond! Coming 2025! Dang! Metro Point 4 Beyond coming next year. That was a first look at Metroid Prime 4 Beyond. After a very long time, we are finally able to share more information about this title. We really been waiting centuries for that. 
Alright. Please wait a little bit longer. We hope you're looking 